Okay, New World. New World looking good, man. New World looks really good. What y'all think? What y'all think? I think it's looking good. I think it looks sexy. I like the look of it. What if you could make it better? What if you could make it better like that? Holy cow. Okay. What if you could get it to look like this? And that's exactly what I'm going to show you into this video. So, it's pretty easy, you know, from getting it to look like this into this. It's called reshade. I reshaded pretty much any MMO I play to see if I can make it look better, regardless of how good the game actually looks. Uh, because I always think that there's some room for improvement. So, I play the game like this. And, um... Yeah, there's really not much. There's 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 not much to it. It's pretty easy. So let's quit yapping and let's get right into it. So let me pull up a browser here. <clears throat> it's called Reshade. I'm pretty sure most of y'all heard this before. It's an advanced post-processing software. <clears throat> you just download it real quick. It's super small. Uh, after you download it, you go to here. You double-click it. Uh, boom. Let's go ahead and just double click it. <clears throat> Asks you what game you want to install it on. All right, I want to install it on New World. So where's New World? Um, <clears throat> oh, here's so there it is. So New World. You hit next. Uh, New World's a DirectX project. It's going to be ten or higher for sure. So you click that. You hit next. Uh, I already have it installed. Uh, but then it's going to ask you if uh, what type of. Uh, <clears throat> There's different types of packages that you can download. And honestly, just for the sake of simplicity, you can download them all. I don't you won't need them all, but it's not gonna really hurt you in any way. Uh, once you install that to the game, you boot it up, and then you hit the home button. You can hit the skip the tutorial button, because we don't need that, <clears throat> and it gives you a huge list of different things to modify the game. Now, I don't do anything crazy. I don't do anything insane. All I use is HDR, Curves, and Lumen Sharpen. That is all I use. I haven't even tweaked with the individual uh, post-processing configurations. I, I haven't messed with them. I just enabled them, and it looks really good. Now, you can enable Bloom. So, Bloom is a thing that I've messed with a couple times. Uh, the Bloom that works the best was Magic Bloom. Um, active on top. Uh, probably doesn't change a whole lot now. During the daytime, the sun definitely has more glow to it. The moon's a lot brighter. Uh, I think for photos and stuff, I think this kind of looks appealing. But for normal gameplay, I don't like it. So I do have it disabled. <clears throat> but Magic Bloom is the one that you're going to want. All the other ones kind of suck. Um... But yeah, that's really all there is to it. As But it does eat some frames for sure. Um, as far as what I use for in-game settings, uh, 1080p, uncapped for FPS. Uh, though I use uh, Rivia Tuner to cap my FPS. So effects I put on low just to keep from frame dips during big fights. <clears throat> Lighting details I have very, uh, very high. Object details medium. Terrain quality is medium. These two are really low. Uh, shadows can really kill your frame rate in pretty much any game, and it's really not that important, at least in my opinion. Post-processing is things like Bloom, MXAO, uh, all those extra pretty things. They usually tank your frame rates pretty hard, <clears throat> and they also add little to no visual aesthetic, at least in my opinion. So I don't like post-processing, uh, not in the game. I like to control it myself via reshade. <clears throat> But then you've got terrain details. Like I said, I got medium. Texture details have high, and then water detail has a very high. And then all the off, 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 on. <clears throat> so I get a nice smooth uh, 60 FPS most of the time. Um, if I'm in cities, it'll go down a, a little bit. But other than that, it runs pretty smoothly. But yeah, look at the game. It looks so good. Like, when I want to turn it off. It looks how, look how gray and bland it is. Boom. The shadows are deeper. Let's go ahead and fight this boy. You know, 
Smack you. Smack you. Boom. Bad. Anyways, but yeah, uh, short video. Nothing crazy, nothing f insane. Just how to do reshade and uh, how to get your game to look pretty damn insane. So yeah, if you liked the video, give it a like. If you want to see more informative videos, uh, hit the uh, type it in the comments. I reshade pretty much every game I play. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.